All right, what we're going to talk about today is customizing the WordPress theme customizer. Um, I had a lot of questions from clients because they had trouble changing the pictures here in the slider. So I'm going to show you how to do it. It's relatively easy. I know there's a video out there. It's a little fast and people can't follow it. So I'm going to do a little slower for you, people like myself. First thing we have to do is we have to get the pictures that we want in there. So let's go to our media and let's add new into the library. If you have Firefox, you could just grab the files, toss them over, and good old Firefox will take them right in. I think Internet Explorer, you might have to select files and download each one of them. One of the things you'll notice though is this edit button on the right hand side. It's here, and it is also, if you look at your library, under each picture, as you go hit each picture, you'll see edit, 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 delete permanently in view. You need to use this edit because there are, is no options here for the slider. But once you click edit, it will give you the options for the slider down below. Well, you're editing the picture for two reasons. The first reason is the caption, which, which this is all meta. This does not show up on the page, this first part. But once you select slider options, this is what gives you your title, your description, and your button text. So, um, I am going to put in a uh, title, Martini, let's see, call this the Big Splash. Um, I can select the color of the text here and what I want to say in the button that's there. Um, right here, the link, choose a link to page or post. So when I press the button, it'll take them to the page or post I want it to take them to. Now, here's where we choose a slider. You can select a slider if you have already have a slider, like the demo slider or something like that. If you want to name it something, you can name it here and just add the slider. I've already named this one, so I'm just going to pick Bartender. And underneath it, you'll see that <clears throat> under the slider bartender, I already have the martini glass. That's one slide that I already have, but obviously it's not going to work very good with one slide. Let me update that. Um, and I'm going to go back to the library and grab another picture. Try this one here. Um, and I'm going to use this picture. Remember, this is only the, the, the this data doesn't show up on the, on the web page itself. This is back end. Turn my slider option on now. Gives me the other menu. And um, yummy good. How's that? The color of the text. Remember, that's the color of the text right here. Create beautiful sliders, customize. That's the color for, for that. Um, this color select is for these two. Um, the button text right here again. A link. I can link this to um, another article or something. And remember, I'm going to select this one here because I already have it, bartender. I already have it. If I didn't have it, I could type it right in here. Da, 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 da. Type it, and that'd be good, and I'd add the slider. And as you noticed, because I did add to slider, I clicked yes, and it shows up in the bottom because I selected the bartender one, which I already had the martini glass to. Um, I also have this other one, too. So, boom. There, I have two for my slider. And now I can use my slider. It's ready to go. Um, I just have to go over here to customize it and go to my front page. And what I'm going to choose in my front page is demo slider. I'm going to change that to the bartender one because that's the one I put the pictures under. And save and publish. Close. A little slow today. And let's take a look at the front page. Do a refresh on that. Now I should have my images, and they'll work. If you want to add more images, just go back to your media gallery, edit, and boom, you will have more pictures up here. I'll make another video on how to add these featured ones right here, so keep an eye out for that one. All right, thank you.